It's Saturday, July 8th, and this morning when I was searching to find something to tell you guys about, I found this interesting article in the Watsonia, Wisconsin rag, and this came through in their factory viewer section, a highly respected organization in that part of the country. Now, according to the factory viewer, The mysterious white powder that we found in the White House was actually talcum powder. I don't know if you're ready to believe that part of the story, but listen to this. It was talcum powder. It was found in a box, a box that originally had been there during the Trump presidency. And this box at one time or other contained classified documents. It's very interesting now, this talcum powder, not cocaine, talcum powder, also had a note that was written to Melania Trump and signed by Xi Jinping, the president of China, and it said something like, Best regards, I hope this makes you smell a hell of a lot better. Something to that effect. So now we have the talcum powder found in the White House, and all of a sudden it becomes cocaine. But that's not true. They're not giving you all the facts. Because the fact reviewers from the Wasatui of the Rag have uncovered this information and they have the nerve to step forward and take on these larger publications by telling you, the American public, the truth. And we can believe them, absolutely believe them, because their description, their description of this bottle, I think it was a bottle, it might have been a can of talcum powder, had Chinese symbols all over it, indicating that it was for feminine use only, and indicating that it was pretty expensive also. So this laid in this area of the White House for a long time, because it probably isn't an area that is frequented by lots of people. But anyhow, the Watutska rag was able to find this information out. And we all know that the factory viewer in that particular organization is top flight, a little-known Midwestern top flight factory viewer. And they would not be out there letting this story run as cocaine and allowing the Bidens to be looked at suspiciously because of the claim of cocaine. And who's making this claim of cocaine? Probably a bunch of Republicans. We don't know who's claiming the cocaine. But we have to believe the factory viewer. Because they are an organization that is very well known in that part of the world. And they have not yet come out with anything that has been proven to be wrong. So here we have a national organization in a highly respected publication telling us the truth about this white powder. It isn't cocaine. It's talcum powder. It was a gift by China to the former First Lady Melania Trump. And somehow or other, when the Trumps evacuated, they left this box behind. 
which I find to be astounding considering how many boxes of classified documents and everything they took out of the, out of the White House. And this was clearly in a box that looked like it was classified documents. But it was left behind, left behind to be found. Now maybe that was the whole purpose of it. Maybe they knew that if they left this box behind with this can of talcum powder, the first thing that those right-wing newspapers would declare, they would declare it to be cocaine. And they would say it was there for the use of Hunter Biden. And that, in the Trump plan, probably, if he did, I don't know if he really did this or not. I'm just, I'm just uh, thinking out loud, you know. But in the Trump plan, if they left this behind, then they could run a crazy story that Hunter Biden was using cocaine. It might cost... President Biden the election in 2024. So we have to be very careful of what we see and what we hear from all of these publications. And we have to look for a publication like the Watsatuya Wisconsin Rag, which tells the truth all the time. And you can go to these other organizations like Fact Check and those people, and you can get the truth about the Watsatuya Rag. And the truth about this talcum powder that was in the White House. So I am telling you this because I want you to be the first to know about this in this region of the country. Because I don't think there's too many people that find the information that I find when I'm searching every morning. And how many people out there have ever heard of the Wasatuya rag in Wisconsin? Not many, there's not many people outside of that region that follow that newspaper and even find it online. But I did that, I did that, and I am telling you the emiss, as they say in Yiddish, the emiss is that that white powder is talcum powder. And it was given as a gift to Melania, and it was left behind by Trump. Because he was careless. He's a careless guy. Look at the other shit that he left behind. And so now it's uncovered, and the first thing they do is claim it to be Hunter Biden's cocaine. Not so. Not so. So I leave you with that this morning. The Watusko rag has struck again. Have a great day. See you in the morning. Bye.